Diablo 4 oh no, is the next I'm sorry. <laughs> it's so far, I'm five minutes into it. <laughs> and loot collecting with a fully realized this looks world. insane. It's mm -hmm. not for the faint of heart. It's gory and it's not. unnerving. It's creepy. You, uh... Diablo 4 is all about player choice. Wow. It takes all of the pillars of a Diablo game River and just Blood expands Death. them. With all the new features that people really love and appreciate in modern games. Including lag. Whoever you <laughs> see yourself being, you can create Whoa. in Diablo 4. Buff. It's important to include robust character customization because then I can play the fantasy that I want to play. It allows you to switch Does around your playstyle as well. That's cool. That's cool. Everything feels Love very that powerful. ice move, man. Yeah. One of this the really looks cool so good. Having an open world is mm -hmm. your journey that you it's take throughout world. Diablo 4 is your own. It's like they made a AAA There's game no really and then pulled the camera way up. back. Yeah. <laughs> We've got almost 150 oh, dungeons in the game. Shit. Oh, what is that big thing way over there? Don't know. Don't don't ask questions. Some holes are <laughs> enemy territory that you need to reclaim. But you might have a space that begins as a hostile area. But after you've cleared it out, the evil oh. in this place has been cleared. Oh, it a friendly town. Sometimes it's a new town, oh. sometimes it's a new dungeon. There's a whole oh. bunch of rewards that you get. And what you a have cool a thing! World as yeah, result. no, you can't leave us here. They might come back. Oh, any local events are really cool little story segments that happen within the open world. That's you're cool. Running through the world, and then a local event will pop up. What is that big fire snake? The hell is that? That's cool. Or get a group together and just wail on these like giant world bosses. Wow. Wow. These are events that take wow. a lot of people, and you really want to take a lot of people. How many people are playing? Being able to see all the players on your screen collaborating, trying to take this big Whoa. monster down. It's it's epic. Where did it go? <laughs> <laughs> Shared. It's so easy to create a community. It makes Diablo more of a social experience. We've got fully enabled crossplay. If you have an Xbox and your buddy has a PC, you're going to be able to group up, or you can play couch co-op. Over the couch, couch co-op. I have a couch. <laughs> I have. I have a co-op. <laughs> created specific zones where players can engage in PvP. Oh. Oh, there, this could be uh, this, this could be a ten out of ten game. Yeah, hundred percent. You're also opening yourself up to being swung at. If you're like really, really good, the game Whoa. actually marks you as like a champion on the map. Uh oh. You basically become a loot pinata, and everyone huh. wants to chase you down. That's really cool. Yeah. The last story mission is really the beginning of a whole different part of the journey. Now you're set up for the end game, and that end game is rich with things to do that allow you to get more and more powerful. Whether it's new items or new dungeons or new what paragon boards. What the hell every single was that skill tree? Play, <laughs> There's be new stuff for you to experience. And it's something that we're going to support for years to come. I'm really excited for folks. That wasn't a skill tree. That was Chinese checkers. Just to see millions of people really enjoying the different options. Through the campaign, local events, couch co-op, end game. So this is this is looking to shape to be like the most definitive Diablo of all time. Oh, hundred percent. So close. They can't make Diablo after this, bro. They just can't. This is end game Diablo. This is coming to Game Pass too. This if they say that. Lose my mind. That's insane. No, there's no tag on the bottom okay, left. Yeah, they would have yeah. normally done that. 